It's kind of like Baymax is trying to escape from inside my hoodie, and within Baymax, there's another Baymax trying to fly away and escape. Hi! Today, I'm going to try and make some homemade Cadbury's cream eggs. And you might be there thinking, why not just go and buy a cream egg? It's actually a pretty fair question. I've got a whole box of cream eggs right here. I'm still gonna try and make my own, though. Fight me. It's been a bit of an obsession for me, like wanting to make my own cream eggs. Also, Jamie Joe is allergic to chocolate, like plain milk chocolate and dark chocolate. So I really want to make like a white chocolate cream egg so she can finally try a cream egg or something similar to a cream egg. If you like cream eggs, let me know down below and let's go. I should probably get ingredients before I do that. Making imaginary cream eggs. <gasps> it worked. Making them imaginary cream eggs. And that is how you throw a cream egg on the floor. These are the things we need for the cream egg. I've got some icing sugar, some golden syrup, Syrup, some butter, some food coloring to make the inside the orangey yellow color. As you can see from my half eaten cream egg head, the inside is orange. Some vanilla essence, some white chocolate, and then some milk chocolate. If you want to be really serious, get some Cadbury's chocolate because that's where it is. There's a recipe and a link to its source in the description down below. First things first, we need to take a bowl and remove any actual real cream eggs that might be inside of the bowl. <laughs> On this rather well presented plate are my finished cream eggs. I especially like the real cream eggs that are taking place. But these look really good too. I mean, I'm happy with how it went. You got this sort of orangey yolk inside that matched up with the cream egg. I even added a twist with one of those. You might have seen whilst I was filming the video. This one, where I actually swapped the colours around so it's actually orange on the outside and like a white yolk in the middle. Let's get a knife and see. And there it is, my weird backwards cream egg. I call it the dragon fire cream egg. Basically the you can be whatever you want. I'm just gobbling on now, cream egg, yeah. So if you enjoyed this video, throw a thumbs up down below. Let me know if you're a fan of white chocolate or milk chocolate or more and whether you'll be doing this. I'll be honest, it's probably one of those things where you are better going out and buying some cream eggs because it just takes a bit of time to do. But other than that, Fun time. Also, if you're a fan of Tangled, um, you might see, no you can't see there, we've got the Tangled Sum Sums, because the Tangled Sum Sums are a thing now. I did a review of these, like went over the Tom's Toy Box thing, which I might as well call Tom's Sum Box. I've just been making Sum Sum videos lately, I swear I will honestly make Pop Funko videos and other toys there. But Tangled Review, subscribe to Tom's Toy Box, check it out if you like Rapunzel. She's like, walking along, doop -doop 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 -doop. then she approaches a hole in the floor and she's falling down. I, I've been doing this for hours. I've, I've lost it. Probably better you don't make cream eggs. You go crazy. But I've got the Tangled Sums. I've got the Tangled Sums. I've got all of the set except for Mother Gothel because basically I just don't like Mother Gothel.